Hi Libra, getting ready to do your reading. Hope you guys are doing wonderful. All right, let's see what is showing up for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I was getting someone needs to either go back to school or go back to school and finish a degree they had started. <clears throat> maybe even wanting to do that, but you maybe think it's not necessary or you don't have the time, but I'm, I just got that very strongly, like finishing a degree. All right, what is going on for Libra? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Spirit. What is going on for Libra? Yeah, Ten of Coins. It definitely could improve your income. Maybe um, some... So I'm going to be thinking about changing what they do, what they do for a living. Okay. Yeah, well, I feel like someone's going to be whispering in your ear, Libra. The way he's turned and looking at the page of coin, and he's here. Look at this devil, the ace of wands. It almost like someone's trying to seduce you or lure you away or something like that. It's, it's, it's kind of what it looks like. But a page of coin looks so sweet and innocent. And this is usually someone else's energy here. So there could be someone who wants to talk to you or say something to you. He's my apology card, but I don't necessarily think someone wants to apologize, but we'll see. Yeah, there could be something here about money. Because I'm getting for you guys more money, new money, money, making money in a different way, a different career path, a change. Something like that. Ten of Cups. Some of you may be, when if the market is going down in your area for homes, you may invest in homes or buy a home or something like that as well. But, yeah, this this King of Wands could be a earth sign, but maybe someone who's money. This, ooh, there's an attraction here. Okay, what is going on? Okay, I feel like there's someone who makes you very nervous. They make you nervous, but they're very flirtatious. They could be in your neighborhood. Sometimes Ten of Cups shows me, like, neighborhoods, but um, home association. I'm getting friend of the family, but not very strong at all. I think this person wants to partner with you. They want to do something with you, like invest or work together. Or, But the hidden thing is, the hidden is that this person is actually very attracted to you, Libra, with the devil and the king of wands. So it doesn't matter the sign, it doesn't matter the gender. That's definitely my, you know, king of wands is always the biggest, you know, flirt in the deck. And sometimes he's not trustworthy. It could be that they do want to make money. They could be an earth sign, actually, towards Virgo Capricorn. But, um... I'm also getting talking over a fence, so that tells me this could be someone in your neighborhood. It could be an actual neighbor that is interested in you. This person may be a doctor, but I'm going to get this person maybe um, making small talk. I just missed it before that. But um, something about like talking over the fence, so, so making small talk with you. They may talk about the market, the stock markets or things, just to make chat, like... Um, just to make like kind of like what do you what do you call that like this small talk this person may though i'm kind of getting that they may have a lot of money they're not good at small talk though they're not really super they may talk about like the stock market the housing markets things like that things that have to involve with money it may not even be your thing libra but maybe that's all they really know about they're trying to flirt with you yeah pay look at that page of cups the wheel of fortune five of coins they're trying to come for you or come come towards you the way he's reaching out this person wants you they're afraid that you're going to turn them down i'm also getting they're afraid that they came on too strong or they said the wrong thing or you're not interested something like that because this is how they kind of view the situation now they could be viewing you as being someone who's out in the cold someone if you're single available something like that the only issue i have with this reading and it's not set in stone is that this person could be married the ten of cups being in their energy but um I, it's not the cards aren't really set up that way it's more like they're talking about that housing marriage i, mean, I don't think they'd be talking about marriage but they could be talking about future plans yeah this person might come on too strong you might be kind of weirded out by this person but i kind of get from your reading your person is just not really well versed i guess in flirting it just doesn't come natural to them they don't do a lot of it they may have been like Maybe they got married, they didn't date a lot, they got married young, or they married and now they're divorced or whatever, and or whatever. They're just, um, it's just not their thing. They're not smooth. Even though it's in the hidden position, though, but I think it's more, it could be more they're obsessed with you, find you very attractive. There might be an age difference, which I know a lot of people, I don't know, I get personal readings, and I, you know, I was in a relationship where 16-year age difference, and I 
enjoyed it. Like, no problem with me. So I know some people are weirded out by that, but um, it's just a number. What's a Knight of Swords? What is this person? Like, they're coming towards you quickly. Five of Cups. Okay. Three of Cups. The Star card. Well, that's a lot that came out all at once. But one thing I was thinking, maybe this person may come on too strong and they may apologize. They may end up saying something to you like, oh, I'm sorry, I, uh, you know, said that or I, I didn't mean to, like... Because I kind of get like you may go out of your apartment or home and run into this person. You have no makeup on or you just feel, you know, underdressed and there they are just talking to you and you feel very awkward. Or I'm also getting, um, they just catch you off guard. You weren't ready to have a full-blown conversation with this person when you did. So they might be apologizing. I get this person will ask you out. Um, obviously the three of cups comes after the five of cups so they feel like they messed something up but they want to fix it quickly with you now you may know this person in your job obviously for some of you this person you may work with I get you work maybe you might work in a hospital you might do um, or maybe a teacher I just kind of get like a lot of people around you um, but I kind of like don't let this person throw you is kind of what I'm saying here because I get like there's there seems to be good intentions underneath. I feel like this person what they do want is long term commitment, but okay, they may come across as like someone who like is trying too hard, but yet they are not real. That's not really their style. Someone who. It's interesting because the reading is backwards because what's hidden would look like someone who is just wanting you who's drawn to you for a physical connection. But yet what I'm picking up in the rest of the reading is the opposite. They want something long-term. They just don't have dating or f experience or flirting experience. What is this Wheel of Fortune going to? Yeah, there's love here. What is this Page of Cups? What are they saying or doing to Libra? Okay, so they could be kind of coming across a little bit creepy too. Page of Swords energy. They may watch you. But then again, they could be a water sign and this could be you responding as, a, as an air sign. One more, please lovers wow they may not hold back their feelings you might be a little bit creeped out i'm sorry to say that but and i don't think in this reading they have ill intentions because that's why the outcome is the five of cups to the three of cups like they know they screwed up they didn't come across very well now let me just say this also oh i don't know why i need to do that it's like a mom thing in me like don't you know if this person's online maybe they are a creep i don't know so be careful i feel like saying that because this isn't a hidden it's like i feel like you, like, again, you, you never know what your neighbors are doing. You know, you don't know what's going on behind closed doors. And the mom of me feels like I need to, like, warn you and you guys are grown-ass adults. So I'll just, I'll just leave it there. Okay, yeah, this person, I do feel like there is definitely um, good intentions. There is love underneath it all. You got a lot of nice energy here with this person. I kind of like saying take a chance on this person. Um, okay, tell me something about this person. Tell me something about this person. Libra needs to know. Long hair. Now again, if they, if they, if you know this person doesn't. Okay, if you don't know this person, yes, they may be that person with long hair or longish hair. If you know who this is and they don't have long hair and you do, it's picking up on you, and this may be what they like about you: the long hair. I also get someone just recently cut their hair. Someone made a big change to their hairstyle. I'm also getting somebody is adding extensions in. So I don't think, no, it's this person here. Because, I mean, this could be a woman you're interested in or a man. I mean, everyone could have long hair, but I'm just thinking, um, I don't know why I even said that. But I'm getting that there's a woman viewing who put extensions in their hair or got a wig or got just something to make their hair a lot longer. And it actually looks really good. Okay. I know men do too, so... This person is very sincere. And one more, please. Enjoys tarot. It's so funny because the person I kind of see is very opposite of these cards right here. I mean, they may be sincere, but I see them being very clean cut. I see them like, like they're like somebody who goes to college and gets the PhD and, you know, very formal, doesn't have a lot of, you know, dating, flirting experience. Probably has very, like I said, did I say short hair, very clean cut. And may probably wouldn't enjoy tarot, may not even believe in tarot, think it's foolish. But the cards are coming up with someone else, they're pinpointing someone else. So there's someone viewing that you do have a neighbor who 
has long hair. They like tarot. Um, they're very sincere. I get the very sweet, fun, happy. Also see someone covering their mouth right now. You're smiling, but you're covering your mouth. You don't like your teeth. Look into that because I feel like there is um, some place where you can get them done for less money than you think or you have a, can get payments, payment plans or credit or something. I don't know why they're showing me that, but that's significant. They could be a dentist. Maybe, maybe that's what they're also trying to show me. They are a dentist or cosmetic dentistry. That's what they do. Okay, what else, Spirit, do we need to know about this reading? <clears throat> I'm kind of wondering if I should extend this one to find out a little bit more about this person's situation just for fun. Um, as I split the deck, I do see direction unexpected. So you could have kind of a, a bad encounter with this person, and then the next one could be really good, and they could be asking you out, and this could change the direction of your life. It could be, you know, you go out to dinner, and you find out this person is a really fabulous person. I do get for someone this person is of... Um, their ethnicity or descent very different than yours darker skin, darker hair something like that um, or lighter skin so whatever's opposite of what you normally date is kind of what I'm getting um, but I do see someone who does have like darker skin darker hair, darker eyes I don't see facial hair on them but they could no I don't sometimes I don't hone in that deeply and then when I go to picture them I don't see it I don't see it what does Libra need to know playfulness so spirit just wants you to be playful enjoy this this is a possible change in the wind for some of you when it comes to this person I may extend this one just for fun Libra if I do I'll put the link below otherwise have a great week you guys